Hello and welcome to GTA 5th Gear. In today's show, we're going to be looking at the Lifeguard. So the lifeguard is uh, under the emergency class. It's a D class A. Uh, as I said, it can be obtained down by the lifeguard station on the beach. I'll show you how to do that in one second. Um, it can be upgraded on the MOC or the Avenger workshop. Four seats, 2,400 kilos, rear wheel drivetrain, and five gears. The real top speed of this is 95.25 miles per hour. So let me just show you how we can obtain this for absolute free because you don't need to purchase this vehicle but you do need one of these vehicles to get this to spawn. Play with me like cats and a string. You don't understand the pain of brains. You don't ever want to give me So you can see I'm outside the Premium Deluxe Motorsports which is Simeon's garage and currently this week Simeon is listing all his vehicles we've got the lifeguard available to purchase now there is a way of getting this for free we don't need to purchase any vehicle in here if we just want to do a test drive all you need to go do is go up to the vehicle right on the d-pad go for test drive and let's take this puppy for a drive down to the lifeguard station It'll take one homing launcher, or presser missile, or jet missile, one RPG, one grenade, one sticky bomb, or a MOC cannon shot, an explosive round from a heavy sniper Mark II. It'll take two shots. A tank cannon, an anti-aircraft trailer will take one shot. As you can see, we've just approaching the lifeguard station. I'll show you exactly where that is on the map. So just drive up to the lifeguard station and we should get a lifeguard SUV to spawn. If it doesn't spawn, just drive up the beach and back down the beach and it will eventually get there. Now you need to press triangle to end the uh, test drive. And when you respawn in, just run around back to the front or the back of the uh, lifeguard station and then you will see the lifeguard SUV spawn. This is now yours. We need to take this over to um, the auto shop to put a tracker and insurance on it. Now I recommend you take this to LS Customs and not to your own auto shop. While we're here let's just call in the Avenger because we're going to need that to upgrade this if you want to just uh, enter the LS customs put your tracker on and full coverage and there you go is it for free? Well, no, you have to pay for the tracker and that, but you know, we have to do that anyway. Just leave LS Customs and make your way back over to wherever your Avenger has spawned. Now what do you see if we go over to the lifeguard station, you might be lucky enough to get another variant actually spawn. Now there's two variants of the lifeguard. I'll show you. We've got the one with the bull bar on the front. And the one without the bull bar on the front. It's quite as simple as that really. Other than that, everything else is the same. 
But again, if you're collecting vehicles and you haven't been able to get these before, this is a quick way of doing it. But don't forget, this is only a one life, one chance that you got this morning this week for free um, by getting this vehicle off Simeon. So it's quite an easy way of doing it. Enter the back of your Avenger. Repair the vehicle if needed. You can put the armor on. We've got brakes as normal. Normal upgrade on the engine. Play around with the horn if you want to. Play around with the lights. Change your license plate. You can't put a crew emblem on this, unfortunately. You can't sell it, neither. But there is a way of getting rid of it if you don't want it. I'll show you in another video. Suspension, transmission, turbo, and wheels. Put the window tint on if you feel you must. Don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe and we will see you next time. Bye. Fade away